wonderful Wednesday here at Suitland High School. My name is Dawn Belton and I'll be updating you with the events taking place this week. The television production showcase will be held this Thursday, November 29th from 6.30 to 9 o'clock p.m. The, video, the event will be hosted in the media center. Hope to see you there. Seniors, makeup pictures will be taken on December 3rd in the small gym. Seniors should be receiving appointment cards in the mail and lists are posted outside of rooms 165 and 152. Please keep in mind that seniors only have to pay a $25 sitting fee when you take your pictures. This is the absolute last time that Life Touch will be in the building for seniors. So please, make sure you get your picture taken on December 3rd. The 2018 holiday reception will be held on Wednesday, December 19th from 6 to 9 p.m. This event will be taking place at the Doubletree in Lago Merlin. Today's word of the day is eloquent. This means strongly expressing emotion. A sample sentence would be, Sean, discussing the topic very dear to him, addressed the room with vivid, eloquent speech. I am Dawn Belton reporting from WRIM TV, but before we, end this, before we end this video, let me introduce you to the Waka Flocka interview. Waka Flocka visited us to share his journey with us. And now we're sharing it with you a Waka Flocka interview part four, and I hope you all have a great day and enjoy this video. Because when I was living in New York, I was seven years old, going to school two, three miles, catching two city buses, dropping my little brother off. So New York showed me how to be a hustler, how to be a man quick. Like I, I, I literally was like a 17-year-old a, a thinking kid at the age of 10, 11, quick. Like I grew up quick. So when I moved to Atlanta, I moved there in fifth grade. When I moved to Atlanta, kids was dancing and like going to parties. I'm like, yo, this is unheard of where I'm from. So when I got to Atlanta, Atlanta showed me how to have fun. Atlanta showed me how to be a kid. Atlanta showed me how to how to relax, how to enjoy life. Like, but me being a man, Clean County really is where I'm from. Clean County raised me. Clean County showed me how to be a man. Clean County gave me trials, tribulations, fake friends, real friends. Like, thank God for it. Uh, money, money. Like I, I just wanted money because I I got tired of sleeping with my mom. I got tired of running the streets. I was in the streets heavy in the streets in real life. Like, that's why I don't rap about no street stuff right now. It's stupid. Like, why, why would I tell y'all to join this or do this or flex this? Like, I'm telling you right now, you're going broke. It's over, like. So for me, to, in the beginning, it was all money. Like, when I got the money, I'm like, all right. I had my first, I had, my first years in rap, I, I had like a $14 million in my account. I didn't know what to do. Like, when y'all see rappers out today, I was, it was me and Soulja Boy was the only two young rappers. Everybody else was in their late 20s, early 30s. So to see young rappers today, it's, it's like everybody doing it. Like, it was us. Like, I didn't know what to do. I was just giving all my friends the money. Like, we was going out partying. I'm going to the club literally with like 60 people everywhere in the world. Like, so I just, I just spent all my money on my friends. I'm like, yeah, we blowing this, bro. I ain't no rapper. I ain't gonna make it. Like, I've been doing this for 13 years. I ain't never in my life thought I'd be doing this. 